waiting to return home 10 months after the first of two fires sparked at the Club Valencia condominium complex in Arapahoe County. The people who lived there still cannot go back. The first major fire sparked in November of 2022, the second on February 1st. Now many say their time in temporary housing is starting to run out, although today a son is stepping up fundraising for his mom to make sure she has a place to call home. On this five acre farm in Arvada, <laughs> friends and family are enjoying good food, drinks, and music. But they're all here to support one special woman. I don't want to see my mom suffer. What I can do and what I know how to do is put on events and bartend. James Menkel is her son. When she was displaced because of the fires that happened in her, her building at Club Valencia, um, she didn't really have much of a backup plan. James's mom, Linda Jones, was one of dozens displaced in the November 3rd fire that tore through Club Valencia condominiums in Arapahoe County. Less than three months later, a second fire sparked. In total, 160 units are still unlivable today. James says luckily his mom had homeowner's insurance, but her temporary housing will run out in November of 2024. That's why he's hoping to raise enough to pay five years worth of his mom's mortgage with the help of the people here today. I can't imagine for other people who are in a uh, worse situation than my mom of what they're going to do. It breaks my heart. This is my mom. Hi. This is Seven News. Hi. This is Linda. So nice to meet you, Linda. <laughs> See? So She's nice crying to already. Meet you. Can I give you a hug? <laughs> To have everybody here today to care enough is really a blessing. Thank you. Thank you for being here. Despite her circumstances, Linda says she is one of the lucky ones to have friends and family to support her after the fire, as she and the other owners wait to find out if and when they will ever return home. We've had a lot of uh, fires in this state, and we've had a lot of things happen in our world. But this is my world right now that I have to deal with. And if I can get on my feet, then I can help my friends. In Arvada, Claire Lavazorio for Denver 7. So, so far, James has raised nearly $9,000 for his mom, but he has a goal of $70,000, which will pay for five years of his mom's mortgage. Now, even though she's not living there, she still has to pay for mortgage of that place. If you would like to donate, we put a link to the GoFundMe on Denver7.com. Feel bad for all those families. And going in depth, the condo's HOA board revealed to Denver 7 that their two insurance claims for that fire were denied back in March. Litigation with the insurance company is ongoing, but those claims were denied because of a number of other violations with the building, like asbestos contamination, holes in the ceilings and walls, and a missing fire alarm system. The HOA says the property has made progress in addressing several of those violations.